Time to get up, mommy. Good morning, mommy. Good morning, honey. I guess I'm a little too old to call you mommy, but I call you mommy when I get a birthday present like this camera that I like so much. So you're enjoying it, huh? Yeah, honey. What was all that noise last night? What noise? Next door. Uh, what, cars or something? Nobody lives there. It's for sale. Like animals or something. Uh, they don't have, well, nobody lives there, so their dog's not there. I don't know. I don't know. I'll go check it out with Never my new... Never mind. Stay right here. All right. You ready to get up? Yeah. All right. So, Ma, did you tell Yvette about those noises? Yes, I did. And don't you go out today. I'm going to go over there in the daylight and see what it was. You're crazy. Take some help. All right. I'll take my, uh, my bat. Well, it's not exactly a haunted house, Mom. Whatever noises you're hearing. Well, I mean, this is an awesome looking house that I'm trespassing on their property. The mystery intensifies. I took the dogs for a walk, like I always do, and Byron ran away from me wouldn't come back when I called him. Ran all the way back here to the pond. Now, what did he find? This. Here's close-ups of it. Of whatever remains of it. And the blood trail goes down into the pond. But yeah, whatever it was, Got torn up pretty good. Can you see this? These are like feathers of something, and this is meat from it. Uh, torn up all over the place back here. I mean, something put up a hell of a fight, but it lost. And uh, this is what I found. I'm scared to even let the dogs out now. Well, I sure hope our tax dollars aren't going to pay for the local county animal control because I called them to tell them what's been going on out here at night and what I found. And their only suggestion was to have me come in and pick up a trap. Hey, it's Tom. The sounds have started again next door. I'm recording all this so that I can try to show to some sort of expert and hopefully they can help me figure out what these sounds are coming from. So, here we go. Stay, dogs. Come on, just stay. Can you see that? Oh, it just ran. It was a raccoon. But can you hear those noises next door? Over there, I don't know if you can see that. That's the cage and it's empty. But the sound itself. The sound itself is coming from over there. Can you hear that?
Did you hear that? Holy shit. Where are you going? Shut up. Ma, just don't worry about it. Why? Just watch your TV. I gotta look at something. Well, now this is uh, pissing me off because my mother, I had to wait till she got out of her room to, sh to show this. She uh, heard all this noise at her window last night and I didn't want to show her this, but this is her bedroom window. And I'll take you outside. And this is what I discovered outside her bedroom. You can barely see that blood because the shade's open. But something was trying to get in at least or, or send somebody a message. So I called our local police department and they told me, they said to me, well, nothing got in, did it? And I said, what, are you kidding me? And they said, well, do you have any enemies or something? Does somebody try and send you a message? It just seems like a prank. So that's what I'm dealing with. Anybody got a gun I can borrow? Well, I'm headed next door because I just got chewed out by the realtor selling this house. She says I've been causing problems by complaining and she wants me to come over and show her what the problem is. So of course, Every night, there's all kind of noises out here, except for tonight. So, there's her van over there. So she's here. Miss Davies? Miss, well, the lockbox. Mrs. Davies? Mrs. Davies? What? That's her pocketbook. What? What is a shoot, Mrs. Davies? What? Whoa! 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 Whoa. 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 